Okay. I love these little things. They have the coolest crunch on the outside. Then that wild caught fish on the inside. And they're in these tiny little bite sized balls. And you can do so many different things like our chef Mitch did for us, but take a look. They're sweet, they're tender. And if you're not really a fish person, this probably is one of the best kinds of fish for you because it's not that real fishy fish, if that makes any sense. And they're heat and eat. You can make them from frozen. So you can see whether you throw them on a salad, whether they're the part of the main course. Um, this is kind of fun. You can go ahead and, you know, serve them as if they were like little potato puffs, but instead the goodness of fish, fish tacos. We'll talk because this is Anderson Seafood. And I have to tell you, when Jane and I present Anderson Seafood, it always flies out the door. And we have not seen this for a long time. How long? You have not seen this since August of last year. That's how long it took us to get these back in stock for you. So there is an auto delivery on it. That way you'll always have these in your freezer so you don't have to worry about that. That's every 90 days for one year. And as I said, cooking from frozen, you are going to get three one pound bags. Chef Mitch, it, this is what you're gonna get. This is, he put all of this out here. You're gonna get three of these bags. There's about 25 fritters per bag. That's about 75 to about 82 total of these wonderful little fritters. When I was a kid, Jane, my mom used to make fritters. She would make like um, apple fritters. I, of course, I remember the dessert side of fritters, mm -hmm. but just the crunch on the outside and the fact that a, this is- It's a fish fritter. It's a fish fritter. <laughs> It is. It's a fish fritter, um, which is probably a lot better for you than the apple fritter was, but equally as good. Let me go ahead and throw it to the expert. Um, Rick Roman is with us. He's a former restaurateur. He's a chef, and he is a good friend around here. So, Rick, thank you for bringing more hey. Anderson Seafood. I know this one took a while to get back, right? I, I know, Pat. First of all, great to be with you and Jane. And you thank know what? You. It's Ander Anderson Seafood, first of all. 40 years, the best seafood for the best restaurants and chefs. What I love about this one is taking wild caught haddock from the beautiful cold waters of Alaska. So you're getting that beautiful, pure fish, but we turned it into a fritter. So what does that mean? Now you can use this as a fun appetizer, mm -hmm. throw it on a salad, make a poke bowl. So you've got the gourmet fish with this classic pub style batter on the outside. So a crunchy, crispy golden brown, and then that beautiful wild caught haddock. And guess what? How about instead of buffalo wings for the big game, how about putting a tray of these out with some dipping sauces oh, and you're yeah. eating wild caught fish, but you get that great crunchy sensation because we did them as a fritter. I love these. Rick, every time we have yeah. Anderson Seafood on, because you have taught us, like so many of our experts, like the Rostellis, know your oh, yeah. source. Why is it important right. about the wild cut salmon, wild caught salmon, salmon? Yeah, salmon. No, had it. No, had, had it. Yeah, had right. it. <laughs> you almost had it. That's right. When it's wild caught, you know it's not being fed anything. You don't want it to eat it. Eating in the wild, so you get this pure flavors. You get that great clean taste of the fish. And in this case, we've done all the work. Clean the fish and cut it into these little portions and batter these pieces individually so you get that pop in your mouth, two bite, beautiful sensation. The sweet, mild fish of haddock, which has a nice, rich texture, but not a strong flavor, like you said, and that crunchy pub-style batter on the outside. You said put it in a taco. How about fish and chips and fries and some of these? It's like going to your best pub for fish and chips, and you just dip them in sauces like that, yeah. and that's the best appetizer you'll ever have. And you did all the work for us, and I love yeah. that they come. What yeah. did I do with my pound bag? Oh, here. Yeah. So you get three of these one-pound bags. So, I mean, each one has how many? That's right. 25 to 30, and here's the best okay. part. From, free, from the freezer, like you're showing it there, right to your air fryer. In fact, I have a batch right here that I just did while I was waiting to come on air. Pull them right out of the air fryer, I'm gonna show you. I don't want to deep fry these. Look how golden brown these come out. And each and every one has that gorgeous, golden, crispy, kind of pub style, crunchy exterior. And then inside, you have the beautiful, and I mean beautiful, wild caught haddock. So you get that melt in your mouth fish and that crunchy sensation. So right here, Here's what I did. Instead of those wings, how about put them on a little tray, some buffalo sauce, some there celery, and carrots, and there you go. You've got wild caught fritters as an appetizer. Oh my gosh, she's tasty. My kitchen smells so good right now. <laughs> <laughs> and you I know, love it. Um, 
Sheparek, Jane is yeah. here, and you know, having this in the freezer, ready to go anytime. Jane, mm -hmm. appetizer salad. Yeah. Yes, and fish you know, tacos. and there's nothing better than a breaded crispy piece of faddock with a beer. So, like, think about like, you know, that crunch that you get when you're like watching the game, and you're just like kind of popping oh, yeah. them, throwing them back, throwing down a mm. couple of loggers or whatever it is. I mean, this is exactly it. And of course, you know, making some kind of little um, uh, uh, hollandaise sauce or something to go with it to dip it's them in. So good, so good, and so crunchy. The the batter is so crunchy, and it's not like that. Yep. There's not a lot of batter. I mean, the fish is no. really moist and smooth and tender. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's funny. You know, I I love doing this, and I'll, I don't think you see. I took a bowl, I put a little bit of rice, some avocado, some vegetables, and then I threw in five or six of the mm -hmm. fritters. Mm -hmm. This is like the best poke bowl you could ever have. But here's the it's great part: really good. only about 200 calories per serving. So about six fritters, I think it is, is a serving. So you're still you're getting a lot of great satisfaction with that crunchy pub batter. But you're eating a wild caught fish. And you're not blowing up the calorie chart. That's another thing I love about it. And, and, it's and I'll different, say it again. Rick. Yeah, you know, totally I don't know different. about anybody else, but I get tired of eating the same thing. And we're not going out to restaurants. And now you yeah. can have that restaurant quality in your own home. And it's easy. It's so easy right from frozen. So this could be instead of going to the drive through, this is the last minute. I have to tell you, you should give this a try because the batter on this is just wonderful. Oh. And it's not all batter. The fish mm -hmm. is delightful really really good and you know you can get the auto delivery and that way you'll have it for lent mm -hmm. um which mm. will be here before we know it before we know it so mm -hmm. yeah if you're thinking about planning ahead um this way it'll ship every 90 days you can get that price that goes up at the end of the day and lock in for the auto delivery so then you can keep them coming mm -hmm. well over yeah, 200 you know, of you have dialed in i'm sorry rig um 200 no. already ordered in this You'll have them go right on auto delivery, as Jane said, then that way, because we haven't seen these since August, mm -hmm. you won't be without. Yeah, I, you know what, to me, this is just a fun way to do seafood because you can use mm -hmm. it in so many different ways. And I just want to show if I can one more close up because yeah, it's please. important for me. I'm just going to hold this up. Look at the crispy crust, but look at the beautiful fish, the ratio of the crust to the fish. So it's not like this thick, heavy crust, but you get that gorgeous, crispy golden brown and that bright white, beautiful wild caught fish in the center. It, every bite is melt in your mouth with that little crispy kind of pub style feeling. And I use it as an appetizer or an entree, depending on how many I want. Well, let us know what night you're serving this because we will be over it. <laughs> yeah, really. I'll bring the beers. You bring the yeah, beers. I'll, I'll think of something. <laughs> I'll bring the dessert or the appetizer. We'll find something, Rick. Um, thank you so right. much. We really appreciate it. Thank Please you. stay on the line, everybody. Make sure you put it in your cart. Um, you get all of this in three individual bags. 300 of you have now have already dialed in three one-pound bags. It's wild haddock and fritters. And you aren't doing any of the hard work on that. Ooh, that's good. Oh, here's the dessert I'm going to bring. Oh, okay, this, this, this is sweet.